Hi guys, welcome to Team Tech Dome. In this video, we're going to learn how to read a data set that is in JSON format using Pandas. If you're doing data analysis, for instance, you will notice that your data set can come in a variety of formats. You could have your you could have your data set as a CSV file, it could be an Excel file, even a text file. Yeah, you could have JSON files too. And also, you may have to read your data from a SQL database. So, irrespective of the format your data set is in, it's important that you know how to read this data. I remember when I was writing my TensorFlow certification exam, and one of the questions, in one of the questions, the data set was a JSON file. And for a second, I froze because I'd forgotten how to read a JSON file. I mean, there are different ways to read a JSON file in Python, but that moment I froze. I mean, I had bigger issues like training machine learning models, but this simple task of reading a JSON file just so I just forgot. And then I remembered Pandas. Yeah, Pandas has a lot of cool functions, and one of those functions can actually help you read a JSON file. So quickly, um, what's a JSON file? JSON is short for JavaScript Object Notation. A JSON file is like this simple lightweight file that is used for storing data and also transporting data. If you're familiar with web development, you'll notice that JSON files are used most of the time, mostly to like transfer files between web servers. So as a data analyst, it's important to know how to read a JSON file too. Um, let me show you what a JSON file looks like. This is an example of a JSON file. It's a rich data set from Cargo, except it's in JSON format, and this is what JSON looks like. You can see it's similar to a Python dictionary where you have the key value pair, the key for the column name, and the value for data value. We have several records of this data, so let's read this using pandas. So the first thing I'm going to do is to import pandas as pd. That'll be my alias. And my data set, I'm assigning a variable for the data set. I'm going to store the data set in this variable, df. And pandas has a function for reading JSON. That's pd.read. That's read JSON. So that is it. And I'm going to pass in the name of my JSON file. So checking this directory, you can see JSON file is iris.json. I'm going to add that. All right, let me view, let's view the JSON file as the pandas data frame. So I'm running this code. And here is the output. You can see um, the JSON file is now the pandas data frame. And from here, we can analyze the data. So thank you for watching. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe and if you learned something from this video, give us a like by hitting the like button. See you when I see you.